This is a powerful prayer based on Psalm 91, which is rich in themes of protection, trust in God, and deliverance. Heavenly Father, we come before you in humility, acknowledging that you are our refuge and our fortress. You are our place of safety in every storm. Lord, as Psalm 91 tells us, when we dwell in your secret place, under the shadow of the Almighty, no harm can overtake us, and no plague can come near our homes. We hold on to your promise, Lord, that you will command your angels concerning us, to guard us in all our ways. This divine protection gives us peace beyond understanding. When we walk through times of uncertainty or fear, we know that you stand as our protector, and that is why we can rest and find peace. You shield us with your feathers, Lord, and under your wings, we find refuge. Lord, we remember the words of Romans 8 verse 31, If God is for us, who can be against us? No matter the enemy, the obstacle, or the fear that threatens our peace, we are safe in your arms. Father, we declare that no weapon formed against us shall prosper. You are the one who delivers us from every trap and every hidden danger. You walk before us, making the crooked path straight, and you fight battles we cannot see. Let your presence surround us like a shield, and let your spirit fill our hearts with courage and strength to face each day with hope. Father God, as we meditate on Psalm 91, we are reminded of the greatness of your power. You are our shelter in times of trouble, our shield against every danger. As your word says in Proverbs 18 verse 10, the name of the Lord is a fortified tower, the righteous run to it and are safe. We run to you, Lord, trusting that you are our unshakable stronghold. In this life, we face many challenges and uncertainties, but we do not fear because we have placed our confidence in you. You are our defender, and no harm can touch us when you stand by our side. As the psalmist reminds us, a thousand may fall at our side, and ten thousand at our right hand, but it will not come near us, Psalm 91 verse 7. Lord, we declare that no matter what comes our way, we are protected by your hand. You are Jehovah Jireh, the Lord who provides. Just as you provided for the Israelites in the wilderness, giving them manna from heaven, we trust that you will provide for all of our needs. We rest in the truth of Philippians 4 verse 19, which says, And my God will meet all your needs according to the riches of his glory in Christ Jesus. When we are anxious or worried, Lord, Remind us of your promise in 1 Peter 5 verse 7, that we should cast all our anxiety on you, because you care for us. You care about every detail of our lives, our struggles, our pain, and our hopes. And we trust that you are working all things together for our good, as your word promises in Romans 8 verse 28. Heavenly Father, I ask that you fill us with your peace. The kind of peace that surpasses all understanding, as Philippians 4 verses 6 to 7 reminds us, do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. And the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. Even when trials surround us, help us to remain steadfast in our faith. Let us be like the tree planted by streams of water in Psalm 1, which yields its fruit in season, and whose leaves do not wither, because it is rooted in you. May we be rooted deeply in your love, drawing strength from your presence. Lord, I ask for your divine peace to fill our hearts. In John 14 verse 27, 
Jesus tells us, Peace I leave with you, my peace I give you. I do not give to you as the world gives. Do not let your hearts be troubled and do not be afraid. Let us hold tightly to this promise, knowing that your peace surpasses anything we can understand. When the world around us is shaken, we stand firm, because our foundation is in you. Lord, help us to remember that you are always in control, even when we face situations that seem impossible. Just as you parted the Red Sea for the Israelites and delivered Daniel from the lion's den, we trust that you are still working miracles today. Nothing is too difficult for you, Lord, Jeremiah 32 verse 17. You are the same yesterday, today, and forever, Hebrews 13 verse 8, and we believe that you are still making a way where there seems to be no way. Lord, strengthen our faith so that we may walk by faith and not by sight, 2 Corinthians 5 verse 7. Help us to trust in your timing, even when we don't see immediate results. Remind us that you are always working behind the scenes, orchestrating every detail of our lives for our good. As Isaiah 40 verse 31 tells us, but those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles, they will run and not grow weary, they will walk and not be faint. Renew our strength today, Lord, and help us to rise above our challenges. Father, we ask for your protection over our families, our loved ones, and all those who trust in your name. As Psalm 91 verse 11 promises, for he will command his angels concerning you to guard you in all your ways. Lord, we are grateful for your angels who watch over us, guarding our paths and guiding our steps. We may not see them, but we trust that your heavenly army surrounds us, fighting battles on our behalf. Thank you for sending your angels to protect and defend us in all that we do. Father, in times of uncertainty, remind us to stand on your word. Let us declare, as King David did in Psalm 23 verse 1, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. We declare that you are our provider, Lord, and that we lack nothing because you supply all of our needs according to your riches in glory, Philippians 4 verse 19. You provide for our physical, emotional, and spiritual needs. Even when we walk through the darkest valleys, we will fear no evil, because you are with us, Psalm 23 verse 4. Lord, we lift up those who are struggling today. For anyone who feels overwhelmed by life's burdens, may they find rest in you. Matthew 11 verse 28 reminds us of your invitation, Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. We lay our worries, our fears, and our anxieties at your feet, knowing that you care for us, 1 Peter 5 verse 7. In exchange, we receive your rest and your peace, trusting that you will carry us through every difficulty. We praise you, Lord, for being our strong tower, for being the rock on which we stand. As Psalm 18 verse 2 declares, The Lord is my rock, my fortress, and my deliverer. My God is my rock, in whom I take refuge, my shield, and the horn of my salvation, my stronghold. You are our defender, Lord, and we are safe in your hands. No weapon formed against us will prosper, Isaiah 54 verse 17, for you are our mighty protector. Lord, we thank you for your goodness and your faithfulness. We thank you for hearing our prayers and for the assurance that you are always with us. As we continue to abide in you, we trust that you will continue to lead us, guide us, and protect us. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray.
Amen. If this prayer has blessed you today, we invite you to share your testimony or prayer requests in the comments. Remember to subscribe for more daily prayers and spiritual encouragement. May God's peace and protection be with you always.